can't believe we made it. Do you think the guys will be okay? I'm sure they'll figure something out. Probably. Well, they'll be all right. In the heat? With the skags? I'm not so sure. They probably called for help and had someone pick them up. Yeah, probably. With a caravan like this, we couldn't help them if we wanted to. I hope they'll fix it. We're not exactly rolling in cash right now. How are you going to get him to do it? I mean, I'm assuming it's not exactly a charity. And we definitely cannot get out of here if we don't get this fixed. I'll just play it by ear. Duck and we go with the flow. Uh-huh. We'll figure it out. Don't worry. Stay here. I'll do the talking. Wouldn't have it any other way. Every mechanic have to be gross. Leaving me out like this. I almost feel sorry for the poor sap. Almost. All right, Carrie, you're three to five by twelve. Oh, what the hell, man? I gotta cut down my wrench budget. Oh, oh hey, man, welcome to Skeeter's Catch a Ride. What can we do for you today? Uh... Sorry if I seem a little dis distracted. Uh, hopefully handing this place over to the new proprietor today and I gotta get all these numbers and stuff in order. No, it's a lot. I don't know if you know this, but the transition from small... Wait, new proprietor? Yeah, man, I got too many locations now. I can't work all of them. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm hoping to hand this old girl off to Janie Springs, you know her? She used to fix buggies and crap on the moon, so I figured it'd be like riding a bike for her. Figuratively speaking, I don't really do bikes, <laughs> you know? Holy crap! I knew I recognized this rig from somewhere. You were in the latest Boston Over Death Rally. Oh, I was there, man! Did you see me? I was, I was waving! You were a badass! Oh, <laughs> yep, got me. That thing's beat up to hell and back, man. I can fix it, but it's probably gonna run you about 2,500 cold. 2,500? Uh, that's a little out of my price range. Not to be implied or nothing, but you must have won a buttload of money from that race, right? Where did it all go? Oh, cause my cousin, right? Yeah, someone stole it. Can you believe that? Yes, actually. Yes, I can. Well, tell me this. You think you could ever see yourself racing again? Let me pitch you something, and it might be crazy. But if you keep racing, I would love to endorse you as a sponsor. What do you say? It'll be great. Maybe like a billboard. Scooter, sir, you have yourself a deal. Yeah? Oh man, this is awesome! You will not regret this, no way, no how, man! Bet uh. Say it once for me, man, you know? The catchphrase? Catch a ride! You know what? Come on. Don't be shy, I'm your sponsor now! Gotta hear how you do the catchphrase! Catch a ride! Hee <laughs> <clears throat> I'm thinking that we put a big old ad on your van, you know? Like maybe a picture of me with like, catch a ride up above it, you know, all cool, right? I'm looking all badass you to put some badass pictures of you with your car and your hat and all that. Hi, Scooter, right? Everything going okay? <laughs> I, was, uh, I was just gonna, you know, Go grab the paperwork, let me take care of that. Okay, bye. All right, man, here's my standard endorsement contract. 
Don't mind the sub clauses about explosions and whatnot. I might have copied it from Torg. Anyway, I figure as long as I'm in there and you're doing it free, maybe you want to splurge and get some of the special packages. I got some good ones. I know it's a big decision. You go ahead and take your time. A lot of good choices, I know, I know. Real classy ones, too. Sometimes I just stand here and, and stare at them, you know? I know how it is. That one would look badass as hell, man. Take it from me, the badass from hell. That is some fine taste, man. Like a treat for yourself and for me getting to do it. Can't wait. Come on in, man. We'll get her all hooked up and get to work. Oh, crap. This doesn't look good. Hey, fellas, what can I do you for? Anna. I just hope that little deal you two struck is enough to get him to look the other way. Schooner won't turn us in. You don't know that. We don't even know what the reward is this time. You just gotta have some faith, Sasha. Out of Tatum. Hope you ladies weren't too scared. Just doing my duty to keep ruffians the crap out of my garage. I'm a real protector type. Why'd you do that? Hey man, you two are my customers and seem like nice folks. If you got people after you, that ain't none of my business, but I ain't gonna be the one to turn you in. <laughs> what if they tried to kill you? Then it'd just be another day that ends in why, ha <laughs> ha. Cause the day's in and why. But seriously folks, trying to kill me ain't that new, I'm used to it. Seems like there's some bad men looking for you two though. You got a place to lay low while I'm getting your ride all fixed up? I don't think Felix is as too far away. If we're careful, we can make it on foot. Then, let's do it. I don't like this. We shouldn't hang around here too long. Looks like he had company while he was away. It could have been Felix. Could be. Come on, look around. We gotta be in and out. Yeah. I got the door. It's empty. That's strange. The can's wet, but I don't see any paint. Hmm. Weird. If it's all the same to you, I could do without Felix's classical music right now. I had to force this on him once his eyesight was starting to go. Yeah, stubborn as always. I couldn't even get him to stop using floppy disks. Who is she? I don't know. They look happy, though. Felix's favorite chair. 
Those few times he felt he could relax anyways. A comfort directly proportional to its wear. You were always a better shot than me. Man, it used to drive me crazy. That was a long time ago. Always nice to see an old friend. Great, a flashlight. Maybe if we go camping. It's a black light. It's the one Felix used to check our first counterfeit bills. Oh. It looked familiar. It's hard to believe that asshole would be sentimental enough to keep this in his safe. Not unless he meant for us to find it. Sasha, look at this. What the hell? It's ultraviolet paint. I guess he wanted to keep all this a secret. Well, he left this for us to find, so... There's something he wanted us to see. There we go. He left something for us to find. Just like him to make a children's game out of something like this. He never could see us as adults. Well, maybe that was the problem. Ah, oh, I see it! Right there! Awesome! If you find another flashlight under there, I'm leaving. Guess that's what we're searching for, huh? Guess so. Here we go. Better double check the contents. Oh, hello, sexy. You're coming with me. What is it? It's an echo call. Why is there... If you're seeing this, I suppose I'm either dead or worse. My plan worked. I'm sorry. Fiona, Sasha, there's so much I want to tell you, but the less you know, the better. Oh, give me a break. Halfway through the con, I realized we were messing with Valerie's people. I knew that, and I never revealed it to you two. Well, if you're watching this, it won't be long before she's coming after you. Change your names. Change your appearance. I believe him. I believe Take he was protecting us. And go. <laughs> forget about the life you had, and forget about me. But know that I love you both, with all my heart. You know, it's okay to be mad, Sasha. Good! Because I am! I'm not gonna listen to another second of his bullshit! I 
can't believe you let him live. Why did you warn that son of a bitch? Should have let that case explode right in his face. I couldn't let that happen to him. It was always about the money. The second a big score showed up, he betrayed us. We had it. We had it in our hands, Fiona. Ten million dollars. Enough to get off this planet. Enough to... to buy a new life. We're gonna find this vault. And we'll be richer than your wildest dreams. But there's more to life than money. Don't give me that. The only people that talk like that are rich. You want a sandwich? Might be a while before we eat again. Sure. What is it? It's some sort of an upgrade. Still only holds a single shot, but it looks like it adds an elemental effect to the bullet. A parting gift. Hmm, this one comes with another shot. Now I've got two bullets. He left you something, too. I don't want it. Are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm sure. You're not even a little curious? No. I'll just hold on to it for you. In case you change your mind. I won't. So stubborn. Really gonna turn down the man's going away gift too. Cold blooded. <laughs> right. You should be ashamed of yourself. Hands up, both of them. What you making? Nice hair. What's that supposed to mean? It means your hair is nice. I will shoot you in the face right now if you're talking Whoa, shit. Vince, calm down, man. Don't talk about his hair, all right? All right. He's good. me going up. You see me looking at you. Make him shoot through that nice floor. And for what? For nothing. You two got every bounty hunter in Pandora looking for you. And you're making a sandwich? Tie her up. Let's get out of here. Ooh! She's fast. Please. You embarrassing yourself. Go on. Fiona, shoot him! Do it. You're pointing that at a dude who has people shoot him in the chest for fun. I'm usually drunk. You all right, man? Oh, yeah. Re real good. <laughs> Look, you don't have to be a tough guy about it. It's cool. <laughs> Hey, man. Hey! Go! Oh, I'm counting these bullets. And they come in. Oh. Bear in mind, Kroger. Take a walk. I thought you 
retire. You heard it wrong. It's my story. Shut up. Is she still back there? I can't see her. Are you sure? Maybe she's on the rooftops. She must. Ah, look out! Sasha! Oh! This ends now. Look, were you there? No, you weren't. That's what happened. Go on. Was she bothering you? Yeah, you probably should have asked that before you threw her halfway across town. Oh, man. Did you see the look on her face? Ah, oh, Athena's gonna be so pissed. Where's Reese and Vaughn? Scooter's garage. They sent me to get you. Oh, well, that's nice of them. What? It is. Come with me if you want to leave. I told you Hyperion some bitches want back. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I promise. That's our ride. Like hell, man. I know the woman that dropped this van off, and you sure as crap ain't them. Well, okay, not our ride, but. Being Hyperion, we just strike one, man. Now you're lying to me in my garage? That's like four or five more strikes right there. Are you guys trying to steal our van again? Ha! I knew it! Oh my god, can you please explain to this guy that we're friends? No way these girls are associated with no Hyperion D-Bag. These are our friends, Scooter. What? Really? Well, thanks. All right, well, if you say they're with you, I guess I can believe that, man. But if you ladies get into trouble, you just call, all right? Or, you know, you don't have to be in trouble to call, man. If you just want to chit-chat or you find a restaurant you really like or... You know, wait, but, but the trouble thing, that's you, that's you. Scooter, you are awesome. This is incredible. You do amazing work. Oh, yeah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Be sure to stop off at any of my catcher rides if you need anything. I got them popping up all over Pandora.
hope there are no more bandits. Bandits? Eh, they haven't lived here for years. The Crimson Lance massacred them. Some say their corpses still roam the streets seeking vengeance. Sasha. Not to be a downer, but I'm not seeing any Atlas facility. I'm mostly seeing dry trash. Would it be so hard for just once something to go according to plan? Enough of this standing around crap. Let's get moving. All right, guys. Sure, it's not a fancy resort town, but we're not here for a day at the spa. We're looking for a top secret military facility. Don't worry. We'll figure this out. Pretty sure I can figure this out. something. Hey guys, guys, come check this out. It's like the whole grid leads right to here. I mean, with all these power lines everywhere, they've, they've got to be connected to something, right? To something. Hey, that sounds good, right? Good sound? You keep hacking. I'll go check on Loderbot. No, oh, couldn't have left me a ladder, could you? Typical Atlas. Hey, guys. Hey. So, what did happen back there with, um, you know, the... Why do you ask? No. Oh, sorry, it's, it's... It's none of my business. He got greedy. That's all there is to it. That's a nice sock. No, really? I mean, because, you know, a, a good pair of socks is an often overlooked detail of a gentleman's wardrobe. I'll try and remember that. Yeah, so... You want your boot back? I would love my boot back, yes. Don't say I never gave you anything. Thanks. You're a lifesaver. You know, any ideas about how to get in? Oh, I thought you Hyperians had an answer for everything. Cool, thanks for the help. Don't mention it. I won't. Like, ever. I literally won't ever mention it. Ever. All right, well, um, I'm gonna get back to it. We'll be here.
this too. Ew, gross. entrance there the whole time and that must be our facility underground hidden doors ha! atlas man so what's next well clearly we go in whoa whoa easy watch where you point that thing this is incredible pristine preserved atlas architecture yeah and it's the real classy corporate stuff, not that military garbage you usually see. I'm with you, boys. This looks good. How about we find out if the inside's even better? No, 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 no. We're going in cool right now, okay? Remember? Remember we talked about cool? Cool. So cool. 